kids i am miss julie today we will learn to solve problems in which we will do both the operations of addition and subtraction before we start solving the examples it is important to know that whenever addition and subtraction operations come together in a problem do the operation that is given first from left to right Let us look at the first example. Twenty-four thousand eight hundred thirteen plus thirteen thousand four hundred fifty-two minus thirty-one thousand eight hundred sixty-four. Kids, here we will first add the two numbers and then subtract the third number from the sum of the first two numbers. So let us begin with the first step. Twenty-four thousand eight hundred thirteen plus thirteen thousand four hundred fifty-two. When we add these numbers, we get the sum as thirty-eight thousand two hundred sixty-five. Now we will move to the step two, that is, subtract the third number. That is thirty one thousand eight hundred sixty four from the sum of the first two numbers. That is thirty eight thousand two hundred sixty five, like this. Thus, by subtraction, we get the answer as six thousand four hundred one. Therefore, twenty four thousand eight hundred thirteen plus. Thirteen thousand four hundred fifty-two minus thirty-one thousand eight hundred sixty-four is equal to six thousand four hundred one. Now let us look at another example. Five thousand three hundred eighteen minus. Three thousand eight hundred ninety-four plus four thousand three hundred forty-seven. Here we have to subtract first and then add. So let us subtract the numbers five thousand three hundred eighteen minus three thousand. Eight hundred ninety-four. By subtracting these numbers, we get the answer as one thousand four hundred twenty-four. Now let us add four thousand three hundred forty-seven to the difference one thousand four hundred twenty-four. Thus, by adding. We get the sum as five thousand seven hundred seventy-one. Hence, five thousand three hundred eighteen minus three thousand eight hundred ninety-four plus four thousand three hundred forty-seven is equal to five thousand. Seven hundred seventy-one. Kids, hope you understood this properly. Now you try and solve some more such problems. 